this lesson, we will continue to look at the green slice and particularly the y-intercept of a line. So let's click that and see what we have. Now notice here that the problem says the to find the y-intercept of the line whose equation is this. Now if you remember the basic notes that we talked about earlier, we uh, will immediately remember here that uh, the formula y equals mx plus b covers all straight lines except horizontal and vertical and that the y-intercept, the place where your line crosses the y-axis is given by the number that fills this spot here. Notice that the slope is with the x and so the number that is out here as a constant is our y-intercept. And so what we will immediately do then is we will go back here take a look at our problem. We will notice that the 7.1 occupies that spot and so the y-intercept that we have 7.1. Let's do another one of those. Now notice in this case that uh, we have negative numbers here. When you are looking for the y-intercept the formula, as you recall, says y equals mx plus b. But if this sign here is negative, that means that the y-intercept is negative. And so we will enter negative 4.3 for the y-intercept.